Y'all, it is hay in the barn Wednesday. Y'all get ready. It's about to go down. Y'all get ready. Y'all know what time it is. It's time for the baddest show that everybody know. It is hay in the barn Wednesday. Y'all know what time it is. It's that time of the day again. Y'all let everybody know KT the bowl. If you didn't talk about the transfer portal, they about to talk about a lot of other stuff. Y'all get ready. Get ready. Here we go. Live here once again is all it's hey the board Wednesday. <laughs> tell you, boy, this week is not playing with us. I'm gonna tell you, man. We got a lot we're gonna be talking about today. Uh we gonna we all uh you know, been a lot of talk about the super 77. We're gonna put that on the screen today. We're gonna talk a little transfer news. We got a couple more schedules we're gonna talk about uh today. And y'all just get ready, man. It's that time for the baddest show. Everybody, I'm telling you, shout invite, let everybody know we on. We don't want nobody to miss it today. Uh we even got some real transfer portal news. Boy, they right here gonna shock you. Um tell you, man. Great day to be here in this region. Yeah, we're gonna talk about this old Super 77. Yeah, a lot of folks don't. Ooh, boy, we're gonna talk a little bit about that. A little breaking news. Uh, oh, y'all get ready. That time of the day, y'all. It's hay in the bar. The hay is in the bar. Somebody told me the train for a porter bus was riding today. I wonder where it stopped at. <laughs> the trans for a porter bus. Has arrived at some of y'all schools today. Y'all ain't even know it. Tell him. Tell him. I am so glad we got a train for a porter bus. Tell him. A lot of people say the game played on the field. We definitely gonna find out. <laughs> And great day, great day to be in this region. I'm sitting up here eating me some M&Ms. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. See, one thing about us, man, we're going to wait. We, we know about a lot of stuff. Y'all going to put it out there, we're going to help you put it out there. Got a little breaking news we finna put on the screen. Y'all get ready. Little breaking news. That's all it is. 
This just the one that went public today. I told y'all the transfer for the bus riding. Y'all thought I was just talking. Tell you, them folks are moving. You see it right there on the screen. Tell you. Y'all listen to me one day. <laughs> I mean Eminem, so I won't say that. Well, guess what, y'all? He's back. <laughs> Some folks say, I can't say, I ain't got to deal with Ryan Weed. I can sit everybody else down. Them folks say, I, I, I got me an opportunity. Them people said, Blunt, going to be ready this year. So we know we got an uh, opportunity. Somebody need to take a picture of Viagra Field and send it to me. I need a picture of Viagra Field. I, I know I'm too lazy to go around the car to get it. <laughs> but if anybody can save me the, the one-minute ride to go to Viagra, to uh to get the picture, somebody send it to me. You know, I'm at like I'm five hours away from Viagra. <laughs> but y'all, this breaking news. Uh, they said he was at Spanish Fort before, Bayside before that. Okay. So, yeah. Denzel told me to put that on the screen. Floyd said, put that on the screen. Floyd said, put my new field on the screen. We go get Floyd Field and put it. Look, that's what we need to name it, y'all. Floyd Field up there at Blood. Tell you. Floyd Field. <laughs> well, we made a lot of people mad yesterday when the people from Blood start talking. <laughs> they say, they say, y'all ain't Debo no more. Debo gone. They say y'all ain't Debo no more. Debo is gone. Floyd say, put big black and show everybody our new field up there. <laughs> Floyd say, put the whatever Floyd said, I'm telling you. Floyd say, put the blunt field on the screen. Lord, happy to be back at Blunt. <laughs> Dang. Oh, I say put Blunt on the screen, KT. Tell you, I don't see nobody. Ain't nobody checking in. Nobody checking in. Don't nobody. Everybody scared to name their school in the comments. I still need the picture of the construction that's going on at, at Spanish Fort. Anybody from Spanish Fort? Mr. Stokely, uh, See if you can uh get the picture of the renovations that's taking place. You know, I just want a picture of the field. The before, you know, before they do it. And you know, we definitely gonna see what the after look like. But uh it's a beautiful day today out there in eight mile, I'm telling you. Them folks say they ain't got no words. KT don't call out our name. Don't do nothing because it's just hay in the barn on a Wednesday. <laughs> Look, that's what y'all talk about. Y'all can show how I feel. Just don't mention us in anything dealing with sports right now. Talk about the band. Talk about whatever you want to talk about. I'll tell you, man. You know, I had a college coach hit me up today. Uh, somebody had reposted the Super 77. Uh, earlier today on Twitter. Y'all, I'll be on Twitter a lot now. Uh, and they was asking me, who was the candidates to replace the 2024 kids? You know, that's on that list. And, you know, I'm looking like, man, there's quite a few, you know, candidates. Uh, I'll tell you, man. I can tell you this, that kid Trent Sellers, 
I dare Faith Academy making a strong statement right now. Tell you. If you don't know who he is, you better go pull him up. Uh, he one of the hottest uh, kids in our region right now for the recruitment. He probably on the road to be a, a four or five star kid, you know. Okay. That's what I like to see. But y'all, I'm telling you. Tell you, man. Super 77. Uh, well respected amongst the college coaches uh, here in our region. I can tell you that. Uh, definitely, at least you probably want to be on um, if you're an up and coming football player. Uh, this is the y'all. This the, look. I'm gonna call it the woke list. You know, the people who woke right here. You know, some people say they're getting slept on, and y'all. This the list that's woke right now. It's a great list to be on. You know, two four seven and all them folks. They got some kids. <laughs> you can look on that list, and I guarantee you, let me find one of other lists. Uh, I think I got rid of all of them. We definitely can probably find a uh, kid name somewhere on the other list. Our new schedule of the day is from Chickasaw. One exit up from me. Um, they play Hillcrest Evergreen, the spring game. Uh, May the 16th in Evergreen. Uh, don't make me ride the Evergreen for that guy. Robbersdale, um, first game of the season. They play 7A Robbersdale on the road. Then they play Flomington, J.U. Blackshear, Washington County, Fruitdale. Look like Central High, the two-way. Uh, they playing them. Then they playing Clark County, Bayshore Christian, St. Luke's, and the Battle of Highway 43. Which I didn't even know happened, but uh, they playing Satsuma. Tell you, Robbers there say they gonna do whatever they can to get a win. Then say, hey, we gonna play Chickasaw. KT always bragging on Chickasaw. We gonna live. <laughs> Chickasaw. <laughs> Robbers there say, forget that. We gonna start the season out one and zero. Tell you. Robbersdale said, forget that. Put us on your schedule first. We got, like, we getting more schedules in. Y'all know I love to see them schedules. Y'all keep sending them schedules, and we're going to keep putting them on here. Let me run a quick commercial, y'all, so we can get this schedule and put it on the screen real quick. Y'all, we'll be right back. Hell, not really. I mean, it's one of the things I don't think you really got to talk about. It's like, hey, if you're going to go not to play for six hours, why are you going to compete? My bad, y'all. I went out and <laughs> without a little bit too long. Let's uh let's fix this out and got that schedule. So they trying to go get them a win. 
Robbins there say, forget that. We trying to see a win, KT. Y'all, it is. Uh, <laughs> Robbins there say they trying to see a win at all costs this year. They have no problem. Don't don't put us on the schedule. We don't care about if you want a two a. Do not put us on the schedule because we are here to beat you. They said we gonna ball and parlay over there this year. The new century nail checking in. They say put our uh, field on the screen, KT. We ain't got time for all this foolishness you got going on. They say put up, put this, put the field on the screen. They say they are the five A region one champs for twenty twenty four. They say they're gonna be balling and parlaying up there in Centennial this year. So they're gonna get that news to the band director. We're gonna have the Centennial version of the ball in parlay. See. They just gonna ball until they fall up there in Centennial. They just going to ball and parlay up in, in Centennial. Highway 45 ain't going to be the same no more. They're going to have to put five lanes going to Centennial in a minute. All roads lead to Centennial. Tell you, y'all keep sending them schedules. We're going to keep putting them on the screen. Man, we're going to have a whole 5A, all their schedules in a minute. 5A and 6A, I really appreciate the 5A schools and they parents and supporters sending in these schedules so we can put them on the screen. Say, ooh, Faith Academy. They start a week later with no bye weeks for the rest of the year. They open up with Fair Hope, then Centronale. Woo, at home. Y'all gonna have me out there in that game. Tell you, I'm gonna be there September the 6th. I'm gonna be out there at Faith Academy for that game. We'll tell you that. Then they play LaFleur, Alberta, St. Paul's, Williamson, Viger. I'm gonna be at that game October the 11th. BC Rain, UMS Wright, and Tate out of Florida. They just going to ball until they fall out right there. Y'all, we just going to ball until we fall now. Y'all get ready. One, two, three, four. Academy look like they ready, y'all. I'm going to be there September the 6th. Y'all get ready. Today, we getting a schedule. I need that fancy Centronale schedule y'all got up there. So we going to be done putting the flow schedule together in, by, in a minute. Hey. <laughs> We need all the schedules, y'all. If you got it, send it to us. We definitely gonna put them on the screen. I want all the schedules. We're gonna have all the real school schedules in a minute. Okay. All the pretenders. We don't need them anyway. I got this old schedule here from Daphne. I open up with McGill Tuna. 
Man, they play Pine Forest at Mary G. Ooh, that's another big game on the six. At Foley, Baker at home, Spanish Fort, at Spanish Fort, Davidson, Alma Bryant, Fairhope, and Robertsdale. What? But they gonna play Robertsdale the last week to make sure they go out, <laughs> go out with a win. Boy, I swear. Y'all do Robertsdale so wrong. Y'all, you got the breaking news of the day right here. This was sent to me, breaking news. Y'all get ready. You know, my thing is this. Uh, look, I'm going to tell you. It's crazy. It's crazy, y'all. Uh, that a lot of people don't understand how this stuff works. They really don't. You know, some people got mad. You know, they was talking about this, talking about that. But um, the train for portal. I told y'all that bus rolling. Y'all, y'all just thought I was talking. And KT don't know what he's talking about. Oh, uh, see. Well, I tell you, the transfer portal is rolling. We are getting ready for the final chapter. Football showcase. We just gonna ball until we fall. The new century now. They say put us back on the screen, KT. We ain't got no time. You worried about that? Okay. <laughs> Hey, they better get on the train to get off the track. <laughs> Tell you. And I want people to understand it's uh it's probably more kids transferring. I, I don't want nobody to think them, you know, they just one kid uh, and several kids on campus today. Uh, visiting schools. Uh, Y'all get ready now. I'm trying to tell you. Okay, we're just going to ball until we fall. We're going to ball until we fall, y'all. Y'all get ready. But man, I'm telling you. We are getting ready to find a chapter, y'all.
telling you, we are getting ready, y'all. Whether you getting ready or not, we're going to get ready for you. On the other panel to come on today if they coming. Break this down a little bit. Break down these schedules we have. That time of the year, y'all. Y'all get ready. It's that time. Boy, spring training knocking on the door. Tell you, we got spring training knocking on the door. Tell y'all get ready, man. We are getting ready, y'all. On the hay and the barn Wednesday. Let me go down this list. Tell you, man, the Super 77 wasn't no bad list last year now. I'm telling you, you know, great group of kids. I'm going to go down that list real quick. I'm going to break it down real quick.
Who is the robbers deal of Sixer? Ooh, that's a good question. Tell you he's out of blunt and Murphy. But blunt said it. Just talking about the last couple of years. Everybody thinking it's gonna be mercy. Everybody loves them. I say it's gonna be a lot of them going for you know they going for um you know road game you know you can force what everybody think about that now you add good shows to this six a region one and you know and then man it's a totally different animal Now, we're going to talk about the seven quarterbacks that made the Super 77, 2025 quarterback, KJ Lacey, Sarah Land, 2024, Josh Flowers, a Baker, 2026 quarterback, Landon Duckworth, Jackson, 2024 quarterback, Jerry Hollins, a Mary G, 2024 quarterback, Mar Yellen, DC Rain, 2027 quarterback, Gunnar Rivers of St. Michael. Five quarterback Brayden Hutner of Leroy, and then you're going over the wide receivers, and you got Ryan Williams, four wide receiver, 2024 wide receiver Perry Thompson, Foley, 2025 wide receiver Derek Smith, 2024 wide receiver Bryce Kane, 2024 wide receiver Jerry and Graham Viger, uh, 2024 wide receiver. Uh, KJ Beckham Baker, uh, 2025 wide receiver. Carson C.D. Hill, Sarah Land, 2024 wide receiver. Antoine Mitchell, you follow, uh, 2024 wide receiver. James Bolton. Yeah, that's a big loss for me, G. James Bolton, uh, 2024 wide receiver. Taylor Cromedy, uh, Leroy High School. Uh, 2025 wide receiver Dylan Alfred and 2025 wide receiver Eric Smith from Southside Selma. Then you talking about the running back Sante Mac Williams, 2025 running back Sierra Lynn, 2024 running back Derek Butler, uh, 2025 running back Alvin Henderson Elba, 2024 running back Jamarian Burnett, Andalusia, 2025 running back. Keyshawn Rousey, Demopolis, 2024 running back, Bryce Dowling, DC Rain, 2024 running back, Nick Clark, Daphne, 2024 running back, Cole Nero, Foley, 2026 running back, PJ Brown from Mobile Christian, 2027 running back, EJ Crowell uh, from Jackson, 2025 running back, Green, Carlos Green Pants, Benjamin Viger. 2025 running back Colin Wilson of Gulf Shores. Then we go time to the lineman. We got 2025 O lineman Michael Dubose. 2024 O lineman Asher Hill, St. Paul's. 2024 
2024 O lineman Logan Joe Ellenbeck, 2024 O lineman Hayden Brill of UMS Wright, 2025 O lineman Carter Smith Williamson, 2024 O lineman Dalen Martin Sarah Lane, 2024 O lineman Diego Camboa Mobile Christian. 2025 O-Lyman Bocago, Mobile Christian, and 2024 O-Lyman Bryson Chester. But, man, you know, you, man, you just go down that list of offensive players, and, man, it's just so many great kids that stand out, you know, and, you know, there's quite a few of those kids coming back this year, you know, that's going to be back on the Super 77 probably again next year. You know, for next season, that especially in the preseason, unless some kids come out of nowhere, you know, you know, we got a lot of move-ins coming in from outside our region that's moving in. So, you know, we're going to talk about the D-linemen now, 2024 D-Miles, Adams, Flemington, uh, Cole, McConney from over there at uh, Spanish Ford, KJ Norwood, Theodore. Landon uh, Meat Marshall from Andalusia, uh, 2025. Big Tony Coleman from uh, Sarah Land, 2024. Ashton Wright, BC Wayne. Trey Matthews from out there, Mobile Christian. And from what I heard, Fort Floyd, they once view call has transferred from Mobile Christian. So that's, a, that's another that opened up. Then you Juice Gordon, 2026, defensive back Juice Gordon from Jackson, Taj Overton, 2025, Williamson, 2026, uh, DB Williamson, uh, Jermaine McCree, uh, Brandon Pierpore from Volume, uh, Brayton Jackson from Gulf Shores, and 2025, Buster Malone from Volume. Then we talk about the linebackers, Tank Jones, 2026 linebacker out there at St. Paul's, 2024 linebacker Sterling Dixon gone, Bobby Pruitt from Theodore gone, 2025 linebacker Miles Johnson from T.R. Miller on this list, one of the top linebackers, 2027 linebacker Ellis McGaskin from Williamson on this list. Jay Moss from You Follow, he gone. Jamison Curtis from Sarah Land gone. Uh, Bishop Burkhalter is back. 2025 kid from Spanish Fort. Kingston Lowe from Gulf Shores gone. 2025 linebacker Ricky the Train Nichols from BC Rain is back. Cam Weaver from Andalusia gone. 2025 linebacker Cantonio Kelly, Mobile Christian. Yusuf Clark, 2025 linebacker from Williamson. Shadaris Tudor, uh, 2026 linebacker from Cottage Hill. And 2026 linebacker Jamaica Garrett of Gulf Shores. And I, we only had six two way players to make the list. Uh, all seniors, Ronnie Raw, Gulf Shores, Tiny Goodwill, Faith Academy, Tony Coleman, you follow, uh, Quint Odom. Scammy Academy, MJ Moore, Mobile Christian, and AJ Ezel rounds out this Super 77. So, y'all, it's a bunch of kids. Y'all, they got them. A lot of kids has got to uh, replace people on this list. Tell me. A lot of kids. Man. We ran down the Super 77. How did you get on the Super 77? You know, <laughs> Warren hit it on the head today, y'all. Let me flip it. <laughs> oh, boy. Fix your highlight films, man. Some of y'all highlight films are out of order. Put your five best plays at the beginning of your highlight film. 
And if you don't have five good plays, don't do one. I'm just, you know, I'm just going to be honest with you. It'll be better off not doing one than your five best plays uh, not being that good. You don't have five spectacular plays in high in the world, or you're going to be able to play at a high level on the next level anyway, you know. And, you know, that's the that's the hardest pill to swallow. And linebackers, they don't want to see y'all slanging people. They want to see y'all getting, you, you know, getting up in there, tackling. You know, all that slanging, you ain't going to do that on the next level. They're going to spin out of that and take that thing to the house on you. And I tell you, the day of hay in the barn Wednesday. It's kind of quiet today, other than the transfer portal heating up. It was a quiet day today. A lot of kids' positions in jeopardy. I can tell y'all that. <laughs> Woo. Some of these transfers is trying to get in some of these schools. They're not coming to sit on the sideline, y'all. I'm just going to be honest with you. Uh, they definitely trying to come play. Uh, words of advice. All the words of advice I have for a lot of people. Don't miss no coach bad side because especially when you get these transfers come in you one injury away one bad day away from being on the bench and i'm telling you man it's some people they don't talk so much noise they can't afford for their kid to be on the sideline i'll tell you that right now so y'all i ain't trying to be on here all day i ain't gonna lie I'm not trying to get the Academy Award for the longest show anymore. So, I wonder what these kids are doing. Just some kids. I'm keeping my eye on. Let's see on our hand a ball on Wednesday. Let's see. Oh, what these guys are doing. You know what I'm saying? The kids at the rings uh showcase. Too much bragging can back for only bread on my boy out there again. Exactly. And you know, you know, my thing, a lot of people think their kid can't be replaced, man. Some of these kids are one transfer away from the sideline. And please don't let it be two transfer. You might be want to transfer yourself. You know, so you gotta be careful. Cause man, there's some kids out there. You know, I was talking about Carter Day yesterday. He here on this picture. Uh, one of the great kids. You know, we did this after the mega showcase. Uh, top 10 players that was at that event. Um, Jalen Scott, Ricky Nichols. Um, kid from Choctaw County. Got Jameson Roberts, Nick Strickland from down in Mississippi. Cyber Carter Davis, Sean um, from over there at the floor. You got bow legs out there, Blunt, one of the top 10 players at that event, and Jamaica Garrett from Gulf Shores. So, 
you know, a lot of people might be talking about blunt and all that, but they got players that's gonna be climbing up them rankings, you know, so to speak. And you might think you're ahead of those people, and they be way ahead of you. See, and you may end up talking outside your neck. Well, won't you talking outside of your neck now? Y'all keep them schedules rolling in. I'm trying to see who's gonna get this final chapter. The last showcase before the spring. Y'all keep them schedules coming. I'm definitely gonna post. Say, so won't want you talking outside your neck. Gotta get them Brant the kids down there to this event, man. So we can start back covering Brantley again. Gotta get them Brantley kids down at the event so we can put Brantley back on our uh, region. Definitely gonna get these schedules on here, So we appreciate everybody sending us these schedules. We definitely gonna get them on the screen and tell them. Oh yeah. We go pull up some of these schedules real quick. Man, y'all better remind me about basketball. I sure be forgetting. Y'all make sure y'all send them recommendations in. Oh. Uh, all right, man. Get them top 100 nominations in. Yeah, so I showed you that. Man, y'all better get them top 100 nominations. They say nobody does it better than Icon Sport Southeast. They say nobody. The most unbiased show in this region. The most unbiased show in this region. Y'all get ready. We about to add some more schedules. Make us cover y'all. Send us your schedule. Wake up, Mr. Prince. It's a great day to be in this region. I can tell y'all that. Tell you. Tell you. The bus has been rolling today, y'all. I can tell y'all that. Some of y'all, some of y'all don't want to hear that. Some of y'all kids about to be on the bench. <laughs> you about to lose your job. 
Hey, you mess around with this bus. This bus is pull up at your school. You about to lose your job. Oh yeah, we need them over there. Keep sharing it. Somebody will sign up. Make sure y'all sharing those uh showcase posts, man. Somebody, somebody on your friend that might have a kid that need to be seen, that want to be seen. You know, there's a lot of kids want to be seen. They just don't know about it. Y'all help us with that. We don't want to make it look like they didn't know. Y'all help us share. Tell them. Let me put some of these schedules on the screen that we just got. I know the people in 4A glad this team gone. Uh -oh. I'm finna put on the screen. A lot of people glad this team here gone. Jeez. A lot of people glad these folks here gone. Andalusia. Oh yeah, turn for wide open. See. Let me look at this Andalusia schedule real quick. Andalusia, uh God, God, they open up with. They doing they seeing like the first game of the season. God, God. And Lucy say, forget that we're doing our senior night, the first game of the season against Enterprise in a scrimmage game. Man, that's a real game. They play Enterprise first game. Then they go to Hillcrest, to Headland, Greenville for homecoming, Pace, Florida, at home, Bill Gord on the road, Charles Henderson on the road. You follow. Y'all circle that game. I might be there October 11th. Then Carol. Tell me. Great schedule by you follow. Y'all, they moving back up to 5 eh? I know it's a mad folks. And I'm gonna put uh one of our other schedules. One of the 1A powerhouse schools over there. Brantley Bulldogs. So we can get some of their kids at the showcase, y'all. Definitely wanna start back covering them. That's a big game with Highland Home on the 26th of September. Georgiana on October the 4th, another big game. Florida, McKenzie, Kingston. It look like Geneva County, that last game. Then our other schedule that we got today, Sean. High school right outside of Andalusia. They open up with Hemp Highland Home. Then they play TR Mill on the road. Daleville, Dale County, Geneva. Then they got a bow on the 27th. Then they got Ashford on the 4th for homecoming. Uh, Pike County on the 11th of October. And the 18th, they got New Brockton. And then they play Ock on October 25th, and then they end the season November 1st at home with against Goshen. Tell you, we are just too excited here, y'all. Y'all keep sending those schedules in. Arrington. Okay, that's for the last game. Okay. Dang. Definitely get Brent the back in. I know they got some Super 77 kids. Over there, you definitely need to be talking about. That's the quarterback from uh, Brantley graduated yet? King Case or something like that. What's his last name? 
great quarterback over there. So, and y'all, it's a parent out there. They need to hear this today, and I'm going to put it on the screen. The right school does matter. I don't care what nobody tell you. Listen to the street committee you want to. Uh, okay, Jaden Parks. Okay. Definitely need him down there at the showcase now. Let him know he invited to come down there. We definitely want to see Jaden. Hey, get them kids down there. Mr. Tudor Bar himself checking in with us. One of that the ambassador for this region. Tell me. We are so glad to have you on the show with us today. We glad to have everybody on here today, y'all. On the Hey in the Barn Wednesday show. If y'all got some kids, y'all need us to interview, let us know. We definitely love to get them on the show and talk with them. Y'all email that along with your schedules uh, to our uh, email. I'm going to tell you. What the email is, KT? I go that email. You got some kids that we need to interview, we need to come see. Make sure y'all send it to our email so we can get y'all on the schedule, especially for spring. We're gonna be, I'm telling you, don't make me ride. We definitely need Jaden Parks at the showcase in Evergreen. We're gonna make sure don't nobody steal your kids either. So if you if you one of them schools that like to come to events. And try to persuade kid, don't come to our event. I'll call your ass up. Do that on your own time. So coaches, don't be afraid to send no kid to our events. So you might want to come with them though. Sorry. So the kids matter. Being at the right school matters. So Tell you, Arrington, though, I'm thinking about that, Mr. G Mr. Gant. Uh, Arrington put up points over there, man. Y'all, Brantley, one of them right schools that matter, too. Now. I don't care what nobody say. Y'all get mad at me. Look, you going to know where to send your kid. I can tell you that. I'm going to tell y'all the team that scared me the most right here. One of the other right schools that matter, D.C. Rain. You better watch out for D.C. Rain this year. I'll tell you, man. Don't be mad at me. Don't be mad at me. I'll tell you. They say Viagra by a lot. Another one of the white schools that matter.
So don't forget about Viger, KT. See, the Viger fan definitely not gonna let you forget about this. <laughs> See, they say Viger by a lot this year. I'm telling you, this time next year, you're gonna wish you had to put your kid at the right school. I'm telling you now. So when you sign up for the showcase, they go to cash out. They, they pay for your showcase right there. You just want to send us a donation. So keep us going. We are now LLC, y'all can. Okay. So you talking outside your neck if you tell my body game by a lot. Then what well, you gonna think, y'all? As soon as you say Viagra by a lot, then everybody start talking about this school up here. Oh, 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 oh. Talking about, they say put Viagra back on the screen, KT. They say they talk about Viagra now. They say the new Viagra, we still Viagra. And so you talking about Viagra. The people at Viagra told me to say, let them know this, KT, since, since they talk about us. <laughs> they said they talk about Viagra. Why don't folks be clowning, boy? They talking about Viagra. <laughs> we transferred. <laughs> so that's an April Fool. Y'all, we just going to say hello to everybody. We are getting ready. Y'all get ready with me. We just going to say hello. We just gonna say hello to the football community, the basketball community, and everybody else. The kids matter here on our club sports RV. If your school not in our region, we'll put you in there. The kids matter. We love all sports now. We don't want nobody to get confused. But the folks in Sarah Land say we still Sarah Land by 35. And scoring points does matter. And you ain't scoring no points unless you got a quarterback. And for all the schools that's hating on Sarah Lane, they need you to see a win. We about to get crumped.
You better see a win. That's all I can tell you. Forget all that talking. Y'all don't hear talking with KT today. You better see a win. <laughs> and you better make sure you're at the right school. And guess what? If you ain't one of the top players, you better get on the map. Tell you. Hello. Send us your video. Y'all, we get ready for the top 100. See your nominees in the Icon Sports Southeast at gmail.com. Tell me. If you ain't getting the ball, I'm going to tell you why. Coaching matters. <laughs> tell me. And y'all know I can't leave the show without showing y'all. Tell you, you better see a win. Come on, Lee Rock! Go make me ride to Lee Rock! I want to be like Lee Rock when I grow up, y'all. Tell you. Don't mention a, a football program unless you mention the Leroy Bass. Telling you. All roads lead up championship highway. That's what we call Highway 43. And Highway 31 is the extension. Championships are won on Highway 43. Don't make me ride the Leroy. Yeah, you a bling like that. Tell you, boy, they can't go hunting at night, boy. You can see them rings at night, boy. Tell you. Tell you. Get you a scoreboard that look like that. Tell you. You ain't got one that look like that. Just stay over there in the corner. Stay way back in the back. Let the champs are here. Tell you. We just speaking to everybody. It's hello time. <laughs> Y'all, we just saying hello. That's all we were doing. Tell me. Y'all don't be wanting us to clown like that, man. I don't know why y'all be wanting us to clown. We don't be wanting to clown. Y'all won't be wanting to clown. See, man, it's a great day to be in our region, y'all. I tell y'all, keep sharing it. I see the people coming on. Y'all keep sharing it. See. It's going down in a big one. Getting ready, y'all. We about to get ready to get out of here. That's what we about to do. It's been a great day, y'all. Got some stuff to do today. Make sure y'all get them top 100 nominees in. Nominations. Y'all send them. Send them top 100 nominations in. So we get this basketball stuff out the way. We all tired of seeing it. Top 100 nominees in girls and boys. Only gonna be 100. Tell me. I 
I wonder if it's gonna be more girls than boys. Or more boys than girls, you never know. Hey, we are getting ready, y'all. Don't get mad at us. We just the messenger. So y'all welcome our new school, Pleasant Grove High School to our region. Um, go show us, say we still the champs, KT. Breaking news. Transferred to Spanish for it today. Still looking for them Super 77 kids to fill out for next season. Make sure y'all somewhere where I can sports Southeast or somebody recommend your kid to got our new schedule for the day, Faith Academy. Appreciate y'all sending in those schedules. Uh, Daphne Trojans. Strong. Sent in their schedule. Andalusia and Brantley. Appreciate the Bulldogs. Look like we about to get the Bulldogs back in our region. Get out of here. Uh, we appreciate everybody stopping by. Don't forget about the showcase in Evergreen. Don't forget about it. Whatever you do, don't forget about it. I'll tell you. Y'all, we are about to get out of here. And y'all, we'll see you next time. Let me see how we're going to end out today. Let's go. Let's go back. Let's do an old one. Here we go. Man, we support what y'all do. Man, y'all help us out tremendously. Man, guess what? Woo! <laughs> Say what your school Every little thing that you do. I can sport Southeast the whole of the football we see the ball showcases. We are the new ball. It's that time. It's that time for the bad show that you ever know. KT and the crew, oh, we alive. That's me. Y'all, we ready. I know y'all ready. No wheels around the area. Let's ride the roof if I want. Let's ride everywhere. Here we come. Right now. Doesn't matter. Yes. Oh, it does matter. The job, the only people greeting the greatest people at two in the morning. I see. You were in the book. It does matter.